Good morning. Good morning from uh, the sunny Moselle. It is sunny as well. It's beautiful here in the uh, French Valleys. So hope your week's kicking off well. And I'll just kick off with a, a book recommendation for you. And then we're moving around into the new uh, video suite, as I call it, and you can see, and uh, moving to books and bits and pieces. And I came across this one. Um, the In-N-Out Burger story. Um, for those who don't know, um, In-N-Out Burger is a burger chain based predominantly southwest US in California and uh, Nevada. When we lived over there, we were in uh, Nevada, um, there's always a line, a queue outside the In-N-Out Burger. Now in America, as you can imagine, you have burger joints everywhere. There's there's Wendy's, there's Burger King, there's McDonald's, there's all these sort of things. That's right. These guys always had a queue and you'd line up you go in the menu was very short and only about four or five things on it the food was great the experience was good and this shows you how they did it so if you want to find out how to differentiate what could be perceived as a commodity product or commodity service in a very crowded sector and we were living out of las vegas uh, but these guys had queues lines all the way around this is how they did it. And there's some interesting tools and tips and tricks and, and principles that they use. They're not just making a very good burger, but the whole infrastructure, the way they organize their business, the way they structure it, and some of the principles they adopt. Very, very clever stuff. So I recommend it. in and out Burger, how to make your burger stand stand out in a crowded environment. Well worth a read. Have a fabulous week. Um, more updates to come. Busy week here in Moselle, all in a good way. Lots of clients to speak with. New clients starting in Feb and even got a couple of sales meetings this week. So I will keep you posted. Anyway, have a fabulous week. Uh, like, comment and share. Any thoughts on your favourite book? Drop in a comment in the note below. I've read a few in my time, but always open to new ideas. In the meantime, have a great week and I'll leave you in peace for now. Bye-bye.